Who's normally? I'm Bianca. And I'm Trisha. And for today, we're going to tackle the importance of fish morality and many more. Aquaculture is a farming of aquatic organisms, including fish, mollusks, crustaceans, and aquatic plants. Farming implies some form of intervention in the rearing process to enhance production, such, such as regular stocking, feeding, protection from predator, etc. Why is water important for fish? Well, because fish perform all their bodily function in water. Because fish is totally independent upon the water to grow, feed, excrete waste, maintain salt balance, and produce understanding the physical and chemical qualities to water is critical to successful aquaculture. Water is important to humans. Water helps with the temperature regulation, keeping hydrated, and maintaining body function. Like fish, if there is no water, the fish will die. Fish mortality is a parameter used in fisheries population dynamics to account for the loss of fish in a fish stock through death. Why estimating mortality is important? The mortality rates give you the total deaths of a population when you compare this to the total births or recruits to the population. You can determine if a population is increasing or decreasing. The removal of fish from the stock do the fishing activities using any fishing gear. Mortality due to fishing that or removal of fish from a population due to fishing usually expressed as the annual mortality the percentage of fish dying in one year or the instantaneous rate f and which can range from zero for no fishing to very high values such as 1.5 or 2 meaning that 1.5 or 2 times as many fish have been caught as were present at the beginning of the fishing season. This is possible with short-lived, fast-growing species such as anchovies. The mortality can be divided into two types. The first one is natural mortality. Natural mortality is the removal of fish from the stock due to causes not associated with fishing. The second one is fishing mortality rate. Fishing mortality rate is the proportion of a fish stock removed by fishing as opposed to predation or other causes of death compared to the proportion that will achieve the maximum sustainable yield MSY or a proxy for MSY for that stock. Fish kills occur when several contributory factors occur simultaneously such as prone cloudy weather, drought conditions, overcrowded fish populations, excessive algae or plant growths, and high water temperature. Common causes of fish kills capture stressors include such factors as net entrainment, crushing, wounding, sustained swimming until exhaustion, and changes in pressure. Fishing conditions include towing time and speed, light conditions, water and air temperature, anoxia, sea conditions, time on deck, and various handling procedures. There are several species of predators like birds, otters, snakes, Crabs, raccoons, and even man can be a problematic for aqua culture producers. And when left to their own devices, can cause severe economic losses. Proper predation, management, and deterrence are a must for aqua culture producers, especially those culturing fish or selfish in outdoor 
Fun. There are ways of prevention and contingently of medical treatment of fish are very specific and often different from those in warm-blooded animals. Providing water source free of pathogens. Protection from the transfer of pathogens. Disinfection of ponds, fish culture units, and equipment. Winter freezing and summer drying of ponds. Optimization and environmental condition. There are many steps you can take to keep predators out of your pond. It usually takes a combination of these steps and diligence on your part to save your fish. Number 1. Fish Caves Building fish caves in your pond from the beginning is your first line of defense. Fish caves allow your fish a place to hide when they are threatened. For fish caves to be effective though, they must be placed deep enough at the bottom of your pond. We recommend at least 2 to 3 deep. Number 2. Dogs a dog can be the best deterrent to predators. Not every dog though has be the deminor to chase after prey, so we recommend bird dogs like Labradors, Spaniels, Pointers, and etc. Number 1. Be observant. Being observant on the farm is important. Employees need to be trained so they know when to report abnormal behavior to make sure your fish is safe and healthy. Number two, introduce an aeration system. It turns out that fish farm aeration to inject this salt oxygen is the, local, is the focal point in nearly every one of these hard challenges. Number three, prevent pond algae and nuisance vegetation growth. Algae possess a problem to your pond health when you have too much algae overall and during algae blooms and can help to attract insects to kill your fish. Number 4. Conducting regular water quality test. Water quality is the most important factors affecting fish fish health and performance in aquaculture production systems and to main maintaining viable aquaculture production. And number five, consider an integrated management plan. Fishery management aims to preserve an economic value of a fishery. So now, we will ask a fish farmer to answer the question of our members so that we will learn more about what we want to learn in fish farming. Magandang gabi po, sir. Um, ano po ang masasabi nyo sa mga maing isdang gumagamit ng mga dinamita, makahuli lamang ng mga isda? Yan ay mahigpit na ipinagbabawal ng bata sapagkat uh, ang pangingisda ng ginagamitan ng dinamita ay nakakasira ng kalikasan, mapanganib sa mga taong gumagawa nito. Tuwing anong season maraming isda? Uh, ang buwan na Septyembre at Oktobre ang pinakamagandang season para sa mga pangingisda. Ano ang pinakamatagal na panahon na Pinigilan ka ng isang weather system sa epektibong pangingisda sa inyong pinakamagandang lugar. Ang panahon ng tagulan, yan kasi ang nagdadala ng mga bagyo, baha, kaya hindi masyadong nakakapangisda ang mga tao na natili lang sila sa mga kanilang mga tirahan. Magkano ang kapital na kailangan para sa pagsasaka sa isda? Uh, depende yan sa laki at mm, lugar ng pag uh, 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 pag Ano ng isda, pag-aalagaan ng isda, alimbawa, kalahating hektare ang lupain na iyong magagawing fish pan. Kung halimbawa, total na ng fish pan yan ay uh, kalahating hektare, kailangan mo maglaan ng dalawa hanggang tatlong daang libo para sa hito. At sa tilapia naman, dalawang daan hanggang tatlong daang libo ang kailangan mong igayak. Maraming salamat po sa pagpapaunlak sa aming panayam. Ano po ang masasabi niyo sa inyong kapwa mangingisda? Uh, maraming salamat din at uh, para sa ating mga mangingisda naman, sana ay maging responsable tayong mangingisda. 
para sa darating na henerasyon, ang ating mga kabataan ay makapag, makapagtamasa pa ng mga isda. And I'm Trisha. So for today's <laughs> bayat, for today's video, nag. Lumais kang Arya, nakagulo ka lang eh. Okay na. Lumuwan ka naman. Common causes of fish kills. Capture treasure. Anong kailangan kong gawin?